Nathan, fight Amazing. number two, win number two yeah. against a ridiculously hard opponent. Yeah, he's a um, tough fella, I hit him. I hit him a few times in the first round to the body. And he started soaking them up a bit. Uh, he hit me right hand in the first round. And then we um, just started boxing a bit then. It's a bit similar to the last time really. You know, he's, he's eating punches for fun. You know, this fella's <laughs> been in with Diddy and White. And, um, Sam Sixton, who's like fighting tonight as well, isn't it, yeah. for the British title? So, you know, he's been in with everything and they couldn't knock him out, so I thought I'd just, again, I'd take the, the smart route and just box and try not to take him. I, I thought it was, I thought it was the perfect way to to, uh, to beat him and, and to make it an easy fight for you, because if you would have stayed and <coughs> traded with him in the middle, he would have just smothered your work, and uh, this way you had a, a clear 40-36, and... Uh, uh, yeah, what you'd say an easy performance for you wasn't it yeah yeah it was, it was good. I thought it was a good performance obviously you want to look back and see what things I can do um, for a mood well I know I did last time I was more to the left last time but this time I was, I was mixing it up and so I thought you know it was a good performance for me and, and how are you finding it now because this is your second fight you know uh, um, what you're six months into being a professional fighter it's been good to be honest it's, it's still sort of a bit I still sort of a bit amateurs with uh, with the way I'm boxing. Obviously, as as the months go on and the more sparring with the pros I'm doing, and you know the strength and conditioning, I'm gonna grow and obviously start planting my feet a bit more on that. Um, well, how do you find weight then? Because this limit is 14.4. Do you struggle to make that, or is that something you feel you've still got room to um, to grow into? I've got room to grow into. I mean, last time I was. 14 stone, 12 ounces, and then grew it. Been really working on the strength and condition with um, absolute body solutions. You know, they've helped me quite a lot. Um, I feel stronger, um, and I've weighed in today 14 free, so put on three pounds. Um, but did you have to diet? That's what I'm saying. Did you have to diet hard for that, <coughs> or is that something that you it was just you felt comfortable at coming at that? Um, I have to diet, but it's more just eating healthy, just not not eating, not stupid. Mm. I make the I make the weight quite quite comfortably really. So there's no water cutting or anything no. in that to make that weight. So that's where you've probably still you know because realistically this way you you should be looking at yourself being a, a 15 and a half stone guy who has to pull down to yeah. this weight. Um, in camp I'm usually walking around about 14 and um, maybe 15 stone, mm -hmm. but not I don't I won't go higher than it starts. I just feel sluggish when I'm when yeah. I'm over 15 stone. Well, I suppose we, you, you've also got two parts to your career because you're not going to get the luxury of day before weigh-ins, yeah. where you know that can play a major part. Um, so realistically, you don't want to be hurting yourself yeah. um, making the 14 stone fall limit. But um, what's what's going to be next for you, mate? Um, I'm gonna have to go back to the drawing board with my coaches. Um, see what's what. Um, want to get me hand, little, hand looked at a little bit. Um, Was it just a little yeah, bit of bruising, do you think? Just a bit of bruising on my wrist. Mm. Um, the first round, come back to the corner, said, it's gone, got to get on my left a bit. So, um, no, I don't know, we'll see what happens now. Well, the, um, the good thing about this is you're in a weight division where you're absolutely a baby in it. You know, yeah. what are you, 22, is it? <coughs> 22, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, realistically, it's not something that you have to worry about. You can, you can take your time. Yeah and uh, pace it right for you. Yeah, oh yeah, can I just say um, congratulations to my sister. Uh, my dad just come in and told me then uh, she had a baby about an hour ago, so. Is it very know, premature though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was prem, so it's been it's been a tough few months for her really, so I'm just, I'm made up for her that, that, um, that it's obviously okay in that. Yeah. So congratulations to Chantal and Simon, and I'll see you tomorrow. All right, nice well, one. I'll say well done, uncle. Two and nice <laughs> Take care, mate. Bye bye.